Chad here from CNR Reviews. Uh, we're outside today, and I've got the Breda Nano Subcompact 9mm here. And uh, this is a call to action video. We've never done one of these, but we're asking our fellow Beretta Nano owners to do something for us. Since doing the Nano videos, we've gotten a lot of comments on the Nano itself. We've gotten some comments saying, hey, my Nano's ran great. I absolutely love it. Phenomenal gun. But I've got also a lot of comments going, hey, I'm having the same problem you guys are. I'm having failure to eject issues and uh, I'm having to send it in for warranty or I have 500 rounds through the gun and it's had a ton of issues at the beginning but it's finally worked itself out or I still have an issue every now and then. My problem becomes is that we were contacted by Beretta Community who has a YouTube page that is also a rep for Beretta and uh, he had said, hey listen, you guys need to get this gun sent into Beretta we want to make sure that you're happy with your weapon. And i got to give him kudos for that and say, hey, thank you, I really appreciate that. It's nice when you actually have a representative of a company say, hey, listen, we're going to take care of something for you. Uh, the issue becomes with the second comment that was made and then the experience that I'm having with my Nana. Um, the, the second comment was made was that there's been thousands of these produced and only 30 or around 30 of them have been sent back in for warranty. I find that really hard to believe because I have counted hundreds of YouTuber comments saying I'm having problems. Hell, I've seen six or seven videos on YouTube stating I'm having the same issue and showing it. So I find it hard to believe that I just happen to be a gun reviewer and I get one that's shit and that my buddy who has one is having the same problems. And that, guess what, I can go down and talk to any one of these uh, dealers and they're going to tell me that they've heard the same issue from their customers. So the problem's not 30. The problem's in the hundreds, if not the thousands. And Beretta's never going to know about it unless we send these guns in for warranty when it happens. So if you are having problems with this gun, if you are having failure to eject issues, even one per hundred rounds is not okay. I mean, if you're having one maybe every 500 rounds or so, yeah, I could see that. But if it is becoming a problem, if it is a problem and it continues to happen, make sure you guys use the warranty. Now I have warrantied my gun. I've sent it into Beretta. <clears throat> they sent me the gun back fixed. Guess what? The gun's still malfunctioning. Taking it to the range, I actually caught on video shooting 150 grain, 115 grain and 147, the gun malfunctioning. Having the same problem. So the gun's not fixed, and Beretta is, is, has got to know that this is not okay, guys. This is eventually going to lead to somebody using this in a self-defense situation, whether it be as a backup gun for a, a law enforcement officer <clears throat> or a, a armed citizen uses this and the gun fails, and somebody loses their life. So look forward to the Beretta review. We're going to be having that here coming up pretty quick. Um, we also are going to be having a video of it shooting hollow points. Now, the gun has shot hollow points perfectly. I haven't had an issue. But again, if I can't train with the weapon, and I know there's also some people that only carry full metal jackets, uh, if they can't trust this gun with their life, there's no point in buying it. So, Beretta, you guys got to fix it. I'm bringing it to your attention on YouTube. I hope that our fellow YouTuber and, and, uh, and Beretta Nano owners who are having the issue are also contacting you because uh, this gun could be great. This is one of my favorite guns to shoot because I shoot it so well. It's very easy to be accurate with. And uh, I really like the size. I like carrying it, but I can't trust it with my life. So uh, this chat from CNR Reviews, if you guys have questions on the Nano, feel free to ask. If you're having a Nano that's having issues, make sure you're contacting Beretta. Make sure you're sending Beretta community a private message to let the rep know that there are problems with the Nano. So he can take that back to his bosses and let them know. And guys, I hope everybody's doing well. We appreciate your support. And if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching, guys.